Hey everyone, it's Mike Andy. Today we're talking about shop spaces and offices for your lawn care and your landscaping business. Now, we're going to go over two options that are sitting right here. Number one, we have this beautiful, I think it's 40 by 14 shop space. It has a little deck on the front, a little covering. Nice. We're gonna go over the cost of that in a second. Over here, we got a 20 foot storage container, shipping container, but on top, we got solar panels. This shop space where we're currently at uses both of these. And the reason we use the solar panels is because it was gonna cost us $60,000 and six months of permitting to try to get power to this place because we're on a state highway. Didn't wanna have to deal with that. So we got solar panels and that's what runs this whole operation. Their internet, their Wi-Fi, their computers, all that good jazz. Now, the cost of this bad boy, the container, you're gonna be looking at somewhere between $2,000 and $5,000, depending where you're at in the country, to get one of these. With a door on it, a window, some place that you just can call home and set up your computer, have some whiteboards, have team meetings, get outside the rain when you're trying to have a team meeting, have interviews in, things like that. Fantastic. This bad boy, on the other hand, the shell of it costs us $24,000. Nowadays, it'd probably be $35,000 or $40,000, to be perfectly honest. But what we did inside is paint the walls, we put in trim, because this came like a shed. Like these things are like basically just plywood. We had to go ahead and insulate it, put in electrical, bring in the office stuff, put in uh, flooring, so vinyl plank flooring, because vinyl plank is so much easier to clean with the guys bringing mud in all the time. Let me show you inside. They're already, they're still working there. It's the middle of the day. They're doing office work, taking phone calls, all the rest of it. But the, a place like this, we spent about another $10,000 to get it completely done inside so in addition to the shell actually getting everything painted the electrical all the flooring done getting the logo put up and all the rest of it the light fixtures another ten to fifteen thousand dollars we spent on this facility now what would my recommendation be if you're just getting started is probably trying to stick with a storage unit or your garage until you need an office space like this this is a lot of overhead it's also very expensive to either hook up power or do something like crazy like the solar panels because it's what solar panels are not free those are over ten thousand dollars that's not fun all in all we got this bad boy for about five thousand dollars we got the solar panels for ten thousand dollars we got the shell of this thing for about twenty four thousand dollars plus another ten to fifteen thousand dollars to get all the interior done if you do the math on that we're literally looking at sixty fifty sixty thousand dollars just for these little storage facilities that's not cheap and that's really the value of having command center and augusta lawn cares we don't want our franchisees to have to buy these things and then find land that they can fit on and bring in utilities like satellite internet, which stinks by the way. HughesNet, bless their heart, horrible internet. In order to avoid all of those issues, our goal with Command Center is have that all being done centrally by the headquarters for all the franchisees so you don't need this big space. Instead, you can just focus on getting what we've talked about in other videos, which is these storage containers. Again, very cheap, throw them in there, put all your equipment inside. Maybe you have some enclosed trailers for storage as well, but you don't need office space. Office space comes at a huge premium because I've got to get a power and I've got to hook up the lights. And well, guess what? I've also got utilities. Cause I've, got, I've got to have a toilet and garbage and internet and all these other things that cost a lot of money. So our objective with Command Center is reduce the overhead of the franchisees so they don't need this fancy, fancy shop space. They can get a storage facility or some storage containers via shipping containers and run their business and focus on running the company instead of expensive overhead like this. Sometimes you'll need it, and especially once you grow past seven figures, you will likely need to get an office of some sort.